Good afternoon, folks. We're coming a bit later today because we posted a video earlier this morning that was long overdue. Your guide to sharing this community without sounding crazy and how to respond to detractors with facts. But we're starting now with spaceweathernews.com and finding the last 24 hours on our star were not tremendously active. There are a number of plasma filaments, but they have continued to remain stable in Earth-facing positions and... That leaves the coronal hole directly passing or facing longitudes. The seismic watch peaked because of them. We'll peek in on that in a minute. Peaking until their streams arrive, which is expected to be tonight or tomorrow as we're all quiet in the solar wind streams at Earth right now, and the same goes for geomagnetic conditions. While the filaments are active around the limbs, another type of energetic activity is beginning to take place, that of the X-ray variety. A new group of sunspots at the eastern limb is just now coming into view. We appear to have small, packed-in umbra with some stronger magnetism that will be a point of focus in the coming days as the Earth-facing quiet gets its first test in a few weeks. Folks, we often show precipitation genesis in null school, but the South America rainforest is earning its name today as a South Atlantic low steals tropical moisture, churns along the convergence of pressure cells to create the heavy cloud action, drawing out of the rainforest and into the sea. For those who read the paper that went along with our earthquake forecasting presentation from the April conference, you know that the Middle East was under consideration for extended signal alert duration after the 72-hour rule for alerts left us 72 minutes short of a 6.6 .6 that struck Tajikistan nearly one year ago. Well, November is here again, and on the other side of that range, a powerful 7.3 has struck the Iran-Iraq border. We had a constrained red alert on that region for three days for the same reasons as a year ago, but it expired 17 hours before the devastating event, which has now killed over 400 people and injured thousands. As you take a look at the next large quake of the coronal hole earth-facing period, a big one in Costa Rica, know that that Middle East alert extension is now being worked into the model officially as we speak. More on the model and much, much more in this morning's video. One of the best ways you can help this community is to share what you have all helped create, but to do so in a way that others can accept and to which they will not be immediately opposed. This morning's video is of paramount importance if you ever speak to other human beings. We've got the wind maps followed by shots of our star to close. We greatly appreciate your support and involvement, especially with this morning's video. We'll do this all again tomorrow, right here, but right now it's 12.15 p.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open, no fear. Be safe, everyone.